Welcome to the 2008 Pacific Coast Cutting Horse Association Derby and Classic Challenge in the heart of wine country, Paso Robles, California. This fun event is a favorite on the West Coast aged event circuit. This week is filled with parties, awards, shopping, and is highlighted by the gelding stakes and performance horse sale. Today, NCHA Judge Tim Stewart and the Pacific Coast Cutting Horse Association Vice President Phil Benedum joins us to bring you the championship runs from this great event. We'll watch winning runs from $4 million rider Tim Smith, $3 million rider Scott Weiss, $2 million rider Russ Miller, and the young trainer who's taking the cutting world by storm, Steve Schlesinger. We'll also see NCHA non-pro Hall of Fame rider Janet Westfall in her non-pro classic challenge run marking a 2.22. Now let's go to Tim Stewart and Phil Benedum as we watch the action. Hey Phil, our first horse to work here is Wildcats, owned by Jerry Cronquist from Hooper, Utah. Shown by our good buddy Russ Miller from St. Anthony's, Idaho. You know Russ has won over $2 million in the cutting horse pen there. Yeah, Russ, he's a huge supporter of the Pacific Coast Cutting Horse Association. Tim, he comes out here to the fraternity and the Derby every year, and he's always in the finals. Uh, look at this run right here. Look at how good this horse is. Boy, he's got Brought a lot of drag his butt. A lot of hawk action there. Really doing exactly what we what he'd like for him to do. I'm sure. You know, Tim, this is a full brother to Kittens, who Russ also trained, owned by Frank and Bonnie Martins. Kittens herself has won over two hundred nine thousand dollars. I feel this horse here is about on his way to doing the same. What do you think, Tim? He's awesome right now, I'll tell you. He's got it going on right now. He's by that good horse, Highbrow Cat, who's probably our preeminent sire in the, in the cut horse industry out of a good gray starlight mare, Starlight's Liz. Great, great horse. Tim is a judge. I mean, this cow right here, I mean, I, I'd have him a four or five on this cow alone. You got to you got to mark him all a bunch of, bunch of points right there, I'll tell you, Phil. Look at him back and forth. Horses, hawks in the ground, eye to eye with the cow. He's going to win a pretty good paycheck this weekend, you know? You know, Russ won the first go round on this horse, marking a 223. Came back strong with a 216 and a half. Reserve champion with a 223. Won about $11,574. Here we are, Phil, with Cats Full Moon. Owned by the Brinkman Ranch from Lockford, California, and shown by Steve Schlesinger. From Lockford now, but he's from Minna, Nevada. He's a Minna, Nevada cowboy. Yeah, Tim, Steve, what a march Steve's had. Uh, not only wins the Derby here, but he also uh, topped the Gildan Stakes sale on a half brother to this horse by C.D. Royal. Uh, just a great march, a great young kid. I think he's going to be one of the up and comers. This horse here's won 50, over 51,000 this year already. He was reserve champion at the Pacific Coast in October. Uh, Tim Smith showed him there, another one of our good friends, and uh, he's just a horse to beat. He's Look at that action, stopping hard, all that spreading his front legs out, his ears are up, he's going. you got to really mark him something, I'll tell you. Steve does a fabulous job cutting his cows. Uh, I was there and got to watch this run, and uh, I'm just so proud of Steve. I mean, he he's a hard-working kid, and, and, he, and I think he's a... The up future of the Pacific Coast. Up and comer has done a great job of training this horse. This is another highbrow cat out of a dual pet mare. This is this is cutting horse breeding at its finest. He's going to win over thirteen thousand today as a champion. He's, his mark is a two twenty six. That's two fives and a six. Hey Phil, we have the non pro Derby champ. Pimped Out Pepto, the good gilded son of Pepto Stylish Oak, ridden by Julie McBurney from Burbank, California. Now, Tim, this has been a great horse for Julie. Uh, last year's a three-year-old made almost every finals, and again this year, starting out good again. This horse is a big stopper. Shad Platt has also shows this horse in the open. You know, this horse is one over 48,000 this year. Julie cut cattle good all week. Uh, Mark Day. 220 in this run right here and won $5,120. She knows what she's doing. She's won over $125,000 this year. Great job, Julie. Hey, Phil, we have Jim Bob Kaufman here. He's a $200,000 non pro derby champ riding JK Kaboon. It's a mare by Boonsmall Celina. 
Yeah, Tim, J.K. Kaboom has won $10,718. Jim Bob himself has won over $84,000. Wow, pretty good. You know, I've seen uh, Jim Bob for quite a few years now and showing and stuff, and his, he's, he's really a good showman, isn't he? Yeah, his confidence level is just is just growing every time. I mean, he's, he's doing a great job with his horses, and he's really cutting cattle good. He, he's always cut cattle good, I thought. He's from Clarksburg, California. He's going to mark a 217 and a half to win this championship. He's going to win over $3,500. We'll be right back after this message with more great runs from the Pacific Coast Cutting Horse Association Derby and Classic Challenge. 